Here we have the ROG Strix B550F Wi-Fi motherboard. The perfect motherboard to go with your AMD Ryzen 3rd gen CPU. I haven't opened the box yet, so why don't we take a peek inside. So here we have the contents of the box. We have our Wi-Fi antenna, our B550F motherboard, an instruction manual, don't need that, a sticker sheet, ooh, a thank you card, and lastly, all the cables we'll need. Now that the motherboard's out of its protective sleeve, we can take a closer look at all its majesty. Here we have the 12 plus 2 power stage design VRM with the impressive heat sinks. Here are the two M.2 slots, both of which have heat absorbing armor plating to prevent throttling from heat. We have our two PCIe slots, one of which has ASUS exclusive safe slot metal reinforcements. Here we have the very cool RGB ROG logo lighting zone. You of course can customize and sync the lighting with your other ROG components. The metal surfaces all over the board have a really nice finish to them. The texture really captures the light in a special way. There's a classic ROG cyber text all over the board. Here we have some Japanese characters that read ROG ni sanka seo, be a part of ROG. There's even more detailing on the rear of the board. Here we have Vedetail de Republic, join the Republic, and nice logo placement. My favorite feature of the ROG Strix motherboards is the pre-attached I.O. panel. In the past, I've forgotten to attach the I.O. panel until the very last minute, and that's no fun, especially when you think you're done building. Going back to the other goodies in the box, we have a nice thank you card, because we do really appreciate you choosing ROG for your PC builds. So you can put this on your fridge, next to your holiday cards, and your kids' drawings. The sticker sheet is both fun and functional. I think I'll put one of these stickers on my glove right now, to give it a bit more flair. The stickers below are the functional stickers. They are color coded so you can label your cables. When building, it's easy to lose track of where a cable is coming from and where it's going. These stickers should help you keep track of all of that. All right, so besides applying more stickers to my gloves, the only thing that's left to do is to remove the plastic film from our motherboard. I'll let you stick around to watch that as long as you like and subscribe for more ROG content and let us know in the comments what kind of PC you're gonna build with your ROG Strix B550F gaming motherboard. Just kidding, I'll let you watch anyway. Hello everyone, this is Andy from Ors. Today we will be looking at the motherboard many of you have been waiting for. It is the B550 Ors Master. Let's check out what's inside and go over some of the key features it has to offer. Let's get started. First, some basic info about B550. It's a new mid-range chipset which is compatible with the latest Ryzen 3000 series processors and something I cannot tell you at this moment. B550 is an important chipset because it makes PCIe Gen 4 affordable. In the past, if you want to have a taste of PCIe Gen 4, you need to upgrade to higher tier AM4 based motherboard such as the X570. But now with the arrival of the B550, you can embrace lightning fast speed of PCIe Gen 4 without breaking the bank. Back to the board itself, Let's start with the power. Solid power will always be the core of a stable platform, and Ors is the brand that always insists on utilizing multiple phases of the power to help you build up a stable platform. For a mid-range chipset, Ors B550 Master still features 16 phases of direct power, with each phase delivering up to 70 amperes of the current which is amazing as it shares the same power design as our AM4 motherboard flagship, the X570 or Extreme. It means that it could fully support Ryzen 3000 series processors, even the flagship model like the 3950X. For those looking for a balance between price and performance, I'd recommend going with the Ryzen 5 3600 or 3700X. If you're on a budget, 
then you can consider the recently launched Ryzen 3 3300X because it has been widely regarded as one of the best budget gaming processor on the market. Aorus B550 Master also got the advanced thermal system, including the exclusive Direct Touch and also the Fin Array technology. With the Red Touch, the heat pipe directly touches the heating source VRM components that guarantees good contact between VRM and the heatsink. With Fin Array, the heatsink on both Hemo side and Armo side uses its staked fins design which increase the heat dissipation area by 300% when compared to traditional heat sinks of the same size and also provides at least 30% lower temperatures on Vom's feet. So with the advanced thermal system, Aorus B550 promises more stable platform for gaming or multitasking. Complete PCIe Gen4 support is another highlight on Aorus B550 Master. It has one PCIe Gen4 by 16 slot and three M.2 slots support PCIe Gen4 by 4. It means that it could fully support PCIe Gen4 graphic card such as Gigabyte 5500 XT or 5600 XT, also the PCIe Gen4 SSD such as Aorus NVMe Gen4 SSD with the capacity up to 6TB and sequential read speed up to 12,000 MB per second with RAID 0. You can fully enjoy the premium gaming from PCIe Gen4 graphic card, also the lightning fast data access from PCIe Gen4 SSD. Aorus B550 Master also got the next-gen I.O., especially the network I.O. to deliver lower pins for your gaming. It supports Intel 2.5 G LAN, also the Wi-Fi 6 with 2x2 throughput, which delivers lightning fast network speed for your gaming or content creation needs. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something about the new Aorus B550 Master. This is Andy, thank you for watching, stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you guys next time. Hey everyone, this is Van from Aorus, and today we're going to take a look at the brand new B550 Aorus Pro gaming motherboard. In this video, we'll go over the design of this motherboard, discuss some of the cutting edge features, and then we'll talk about who this board is meant for. With all that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Our new B550 platform is designed to bring flagship level features to the mainstream audience for a very affordable price point. The B550 Aorus Pro supports features such as PCIe Gen 4, which gives your PC extra performance, bandwidth, and speed. In addition to this, the motherboard delivers unprecedented value while offering a next generation VRM layout, improved VRM cooling, and it offers seamless compatibility with the latest Ryzen CPUs. Compared to the last generation, the B550 Aorus Pro features plenty of improvements across the board. This makes it a great option for those who are in the market for a B550 motherboard. For 
this is the best mid-range motherboard that you can buy on the market. The first feature I want to go over for the B550 Aorus Pro is the ultimate power design. The B550 Aorus Pro is equipped with a true 12 plus 2 digital VRM design. Each phase is capable of delivering up to 50 amps of power. And this is a big step up when it comes to power delivery, as the power design is very similar to our higher tier motherboard, the X570 Aorus Ultra. This means that the new B550 Aorus Pro can fully support AMD's Ryzen 3000 series of processors, and even the high-end Ryzen 9 3950X. With this type of power design, you can be confident that this motherboard will allow you to draw the full performance out of any AMD Ryzen CPU. The next feature on this motherboard is the advanced thermal design. The B550 Aorus Pro has the direct touch cooling technology and fins array heatsink, which is found on our higher end X570 platform. With the direct touch heat pipe being able to contact the VRMs, this guarantees great heat dissipation and provides exceptional cooling performance. Fins Array technology uses multiple fins on the heatsink to help greatly improve cooling performance. Fins Array technology increases the area of heat dissipation by 300% when compared to a traditional heatsink of the same size. With the integration of the advanced thermal design, the B550 Aorus Pro provides a stable platform and optimal temperatures for both gaming and content creation. PCIe Gen 4 is one of the biggest highlights when it comes to this motherboard. It has a full PCIe Gen 4 x 16 slot and two additional Gen 4 M.2 slots. This makes the B550 Aorus Pro a great option for those of you who are looking for a future-ready platform. PCIe Gen 4 allows you to take full advantage of next generation SSDs such as the Aorus NVMe Gen 4 SSD which offers unprecedented read and write speeds of up to 6500 megabytes per second or higher. PCIe Gen 4 allows for a seamless gaming experience with lightning fast data access. When it comes to I.O., the B550 Aorus Pro has you taken care of. This motherboard features a flexible array of USB Type-A and Type-C ports. This gives you plenty of options when it comes to connecting external devices. And when it comes to networking, the B550 Aorus Pro also comes equipped with a next-gen 2.5 gigabit Ethernet LAN, which ensures a super fast connection for the best possible online gaming experience. If you're looking for the fastest internet speeds on a mid-range motherboard, you won't be disappointed with this. If you're looking for some CPU recommendations to go with this motherboard, we've got you covered. If you're looking for a budget-friendly starter build, we recommend the AMD Ryzen 3 3100 or 3300X. The 4 cores and 8 threads are great for gaming and beginner-friendly content creation. For a more performance-focused build, we recommend any of the Ryzen 5 or Ryzen 7 processors as the extra cores will be a huge advantage for your next PC build. With all that being said, we hope that you enjoyed this first look at the new B550 Aorus Pro. If you have any questions about this particular motherboard, please put them in the comments section down below. And if you want to learn more information about this motherboard, you can always visit us on our website. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and follow us on social media. My name is Van, and I'll see you guys on the next one.